Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. In this video, I'll teach you how you can bypass Arena Breakout's minimum requirement error through manually uh, editing the registry entries. Uh, I made a tutorial for automated method and some of you guys having issues with it. So I'm going to teach you how you can do with like manual method. So for that, first of all, type Windows plus R and press Windows plus R and type CMD. And then paste this command right here. I will provide uh, all the commands in the description down below. Just press enter. You will get your GPU. I already changed it minus 16 NVIDIA G4 1660. So when you get this GPU, just copy the name of it and then press Windows plus R again and then type regedit. Click yes. So now, as I told you, my GPU is actually GTX 1660. So what we're going to do, we're going to uh, come here. First of all, if we go to files and export the registry and make a backup of it so that if things go wrong, we can simply restore it back to normal. And then we need to click on H key local machine, right click on it and find. Okay. Now you need to press whatever the value you get from this CMD window right here. And then press the, uh, paste the value right in and click on find next. Now it will search the re whole registry for value specific to your GPU. So give it some time. It, it will take like few minutes. Maybe depends on the system really. So as you can see right here, uh, it find one value and you need to look for this uh, GPU name right here. It could be anything like NVIDIA G4 1660 for me, for, for you it's probably something else. So now you need to click on description, double click on it. And then you need to basically replace this name with whatever GPU you want to use. Like for me, I have NVIDIA card, so I can use NVIDIA G4 RTX 2080. Or if you're an AMD user, you can go with RX 5600 XT. So I will provide names in the description down below. So just copy and paste the name so you don't get any errors afterwards. And then you need to hit OK. I'm not going to change it because I already done that. So now you need to go back or to HK local machine again. Right click, find and then search for uh, your GP once again. So what you need to do, you ne basically need to change every single entry of your GPU until there's nothing left for you to change. It will take some time. I understand that, but that's the best way to do it. Now I can like provide you some specific uh, path to the registry entries, but I suggest you just do manually like every single one because that way there's, there is most likely it will work. Like you don't really get any error afterwards and you don't really have to look everywhere to like, where do I change things next? So just stick with it, like change, find text, let it search replace the value until you find nothing else that belongs to your gpu okay once you've done that you basically need to like close this uh, and then you need to restart the pc also uh, some of you guys having some issues with older uh, cpu perhaps like if you got uh, something like uh, for example 3700x and you still getting the error so for that you need to press windows plus r Dev, dev m d e v m g m t dot m s c hit enter the device manager will open then we need to click on processor Le left click on it and then uh, click on whatever your processor name is right click on it go to properties go to details and find uh where is it there it is class g u i d then you need to right click on this value right here and click on copy now, once again, you need to press Windows plus R, type regedit, click yes, the registry entry will open once again. Now you need to go to syst HK local machine, system, uh, current control set, then you need to find folder name anum, right click on the anum folder and click on find. Now, once you've done that, search for the letter and the strings, which we copy right here. So you're going to paste this, click on find next. And now you will get this whole uh, series of uh, folders from zero to F. So what we basically need to do, we need to look for like in every single folder right here, we need to look for a friendly name, which is for me, it's AMD 11 70, uh, 2700. That's my uh, current processor. So double click on the friendly name. Then you can replace it with uh, something like AMD Ryzen 7800X or something else. I will provide uh, some CPU names in the description down below so that you can replace the value here. 
and you need to do this from 0 to 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 a and b you need to replace it in all of the folders up to f basically just click on friendly name replace this with whatever your processor uh, you want to use like for me it's amd so i'm going to use amd1 if you got intel you can use intel ones and then you need basically need to click ok and change every single value right here and then you just need to close it restart your pc and you are done if you still face issue don't worry about it just join my discord the link will be in the description down below and i will try my best to help you out fixing all this stuff and i'm gonna see you in the next one guys so if you enjoy this video make sure to leave a like and please subscribe to the channel because it helps a lot and i'm gonna see you in the next one have a good day